Hello everyone! Today I'm going, I'm going to clean some of my uh, acrylic pour that have silicone and no silicone. But I need to clean first all the pour that have silicone because it will take days um, to finally remove all the silicone in the canvas. And as you can see, it's very shiny. There's like an oil on it. And that is because of the silicone that I use. So this one also, um, there's a lot of silicone and if you don't clean the pour that have silicone, the varnish will not um, stick on it and it's going to be so hard to fix it. That's why before you varnish all the paintings that have silicone or paintings that don't have silicone also, you need to clean it first. So, I have nine paintings that need to clean, and three of them does not have silicone, so it will make it easy for me. And this also have silicone. This one have silicone also, but not much. And especially this one, there's a lot on this. It's very shiny, like oily. And this one I need to clean also because I use all paints that have silicone on this. And for sure this pore will glow after I varnish. So what I'm gonna do is, because this painting have a lot of silicones, I need to um, put the cornstarch. This is the, the powder that I'm using. I'm using cornstarch. I'm gonna spread the cornstarch in all over the, the paintings and I'm gonna let it stay for overnight because I want the oil in the paintings to be fully removed. So let's start.
Hello everyone! Now it's time for me to clean the surface of the canvas. So I need to remove all the cornstarch that are in the canvas. And I'm gonna use my 3 inches brush to wipe it off. And I'm gonna use also the paper towel. And after I remove all the cornstarch, I'm going to apply a Dawn dishwashing liquid soap. And... I'm going to clean also the three canvases that uh, there is no silicon in it. That's why I did not put a cornstarch. So this is the process that I always do in my every acrylic pour and also to um, my acrylic painting. So if there is no silicon, I did not uh, spread a cornstarch on it and just clean it with paper towel. So this is the process that I'm I'm doing because for me it's working and I respect every one um process of cleaning their canvas and I hope you like it. I hope you enjoy watching me while I'm doing all the action. <music>
So I already changed the cover of the table and it's really important that after you remove the cornstarch in the canvas, you replace the cover. And I'm gonna do the final cleaning of the canvas. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna use a two inches brush and then wipe it with some paper towel. This is a damp paper towel, so it's a little bit wet. And I'm gonna use the Dawn liquid soap. So let's start. <music>
before. So I'm gonna use the Liquitex High Gloss Varnish. And this is the brush that I used like a month ago. And I'm gonna use this big one. It's still firm. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna spread the varnish. And I'm going to do uh, the same procedure in other canvas. So I'm just spreading the... So don't um, put too much pressure in the brush so that it will not leave a deeper mark. And don't worry about... Um, if you're not able to get a nice result in the first coat. So I'm going to do a third coat. So I need to wait like uh, four hours before I put a second coat in this um, painting. And sometimes um, I do the third coat the following day. So that... Uh, the canvas, the painting is fully dry. So, and then gently So everything is covered. Also, the side need to be covered with varnish. So, if you can see a bubbles, because the foam brush sometimes um, being too much bubbles, you can tap it like that, so that the bubbles will uh, pop. Or you can blow it also. this and then blow it so it pop so it's popping I'm gonna put the other kind of other paintings into a time lapse. 